Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for November the 16th of 2020. Well, it is titled light and glory over Crete. So what do we see here? Well, looking off into the water here and the land in the foreground, up in the sky, we see a number of different things. And you may be able to identify some of them. But we're actually going to annotate some of them to actually identify some of the more prominent objects here. So as we do that, you can see that on the left hand side, we see the Big Dipper, seven bright stars that make out this prominent asterism, uh, which is a grouping of the brighter some of the brighter stars that we see and one of the more prominent objects that people can often identify. Now below that we see Comet Neowise and that was identified and observed and quite prominent this summer. So that dates when this image was taken to July because that's when Neowise was very prominent in the sky and very easily visible. Between those two and a little bit to the right, we see the bright star Polaris, the North Star, not the brightest star in the sky, but around the 50th brightest star, but happens to be located in a very special location in the sky near the North Celestial Pole. And that's important because it identifies the location of the pole of the sky where everything in the sky will seem to revolve around. Otherwise, that would be invisible and you would not be able to identify that. And it was a great help to people navigating in the days before GPS to be able to navigate across the oceans by figuring out your latitude by using the, the star Polaris. Up towards the top of the image, we see the bright star Vega. Again, what this is one of the very brighter stars in the sky. And off towards as we head towards the right hand side, lower below our Milky Way, which arcs across the sky here, we see the planets Saturn and Jupiter. Saturn and Jupiter are very close together and have actually gotten a lot closer since this and will continue to approach each other reaching their closest towards the middle uh, to latter part of December when they will be very close together and in fact as close as they have been for hundreds of years. So that's a chance to look at a site like that. And then finally just off to the uh, right of the Milky Way we see the bright star Antares. Antares in the constellation of Scorpio the scorpion and the bright star Antares representing the heart of the scorpion there and you can see that reddish star uh, just a little bit to the right of the Milky Way. So here we get this scene a beautiful foreground scene with a beautiful sky scene as well with a number of different objects from things within our solar system like planets and comets to stars within our galaxy like Polaris Vega and Antares to our own Milky Way the whole galaxy itself and we see all of that in our image today. So that was our picture of the day for November the 16th of 2020. It was titled Light and Glory Over Crete. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be unexplained sky ribbon. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.